We're broken. Ah, my mic just dropped. Some bitch. Hey. What? Now it's too tall. Oh. Fuck. Ah! And now my headphones cut out. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> what kind of garage podcast setup is this? Everybody, and welcome to this week's edition of the Half Hour Happy Hour with Allison and Alex. I'm Alex Albrecht. I'm Allison Hayslip. And for the next uh, approximately 30 minutes or so, Alex and I will chat about things we thought were interesting. That sounds like a uh, like a category in Jeopardy. Yeah. Things we thought were interesting for 400, please. Interesting? Interesting. Yeah. That was interesting. In that itself. was yeah. interesting. Hey, that sound means Tom Krajewski is here. Hey. Tom Krajewski. I hear the laugh sultry this I sounds of Tom Krajewski. You and I introduced oh, the show differently, Alex. Oh, you do say we? this week's edition of the Half Hour Half Hour. Oh. I don't say that when I enter the show. You're confusing our audience. I'm so sorry, everyone <laughs> at home. Or maybe I, only, I should be sorry. It only, I don't know it only is... took us 18 or 19 episodes to figure that out. But... <laughs> to actually get the intro correct. Can you believe that we've done 18 or 19 episodes of this? Uh, it's crazy. I was over at um, our buddy Ted's house, and he was like, I was like, yeah. He was like, you've been doing that podcast for a while. What has it been, like 11 episodes, 12 episodes? And I was like, I think it's 18 that's that's crazy. Crazy. Oh my god! I was like eighteen weeks. Yes. 18 weeks. Oh, that's, okay. That's... I had a I had an idea, Uh-oh. and I'm bringing it up on the podcast so potentially our viewers can hold us accountable. Our viewers. <laughs> that's a good. By idea. the way, our, 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 our listeners. Viewers. I mean, ho- hopefully our listeners can hold us accountable for this. I've been doing some thought. Have you contacted the ca- the Canada lady for the wine? I'm. I want to say yes, but you. Didn't. But the answer is no. Okay, Alex, you <laughs> so need to do this. I'm totally going to go back and do it. Please. Yeah. You're giving me a face like you're not going to do it. I'm, I'm no. excited for this. Yeah. So okay. Please. So here's the thing. People are excited. We for were this. saying we'll do seven straight hours so that. So that we can post a podcast every day for a week, yeah. right? And then we came up with well, wait, the idea. We do half hours. What? So we, we don't have to do all seven hours. It doesn't have to oh, be I don't mean hour, seven, seven hours. I mean seven episodes. Seven episodes. That's right, seven much episodes. more reasonable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're doing seven episodes in a row. But, <laughs> but, but, but. Seventh episode, we are going to be so. No, hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. Yeah, wait for I'm it. So excited. Because we were like, oh, we'll release it over Christmas. Right? That was what right. we, the idea we came up with. And then I was like, oh, it needs to be like a special. Like, what should we call it? And then I was like, oh my gosh, we could call it Drunk, Drunk Smiths. Because that's what my brother and drunk, I call Christmas. Drunk, drunk Smiths? Drunks, just drunk Smiths. Drunk, drunk, drunk Smith. Drunk Smiths. Or Drunk Miss. Drunk okay. Miss. That's it. Drunk Miss. Drunk Miss. Instead of Christmas, it's Drunk Miss. That's what my brother and I call Christmas with my family because that's all we do is get drunk. But I like your family. I was like, <laughs> yeah, I, <was> like, <laughs> I want to be part of they your seem family. Nice. <laughs> So then I was like, okay, it could be the seven days of drunk miss. But then I was like, it can't be seven days. It needs to be the 12 days of drunk miss. So then, get this, I looked at the calendar on my phone, obviously, because no one actually has a calendar in their house anymore. (laughs) And we normally release our podcast on a Monday, right? Correct. So if we release it the Monday before Christmas. You mean drunk miss? Uh, the, yeah. The st- well, that's the first day of drunk miss. Right. The Monday before Christmas. Yeah. 12 days later is the first day of the new year. What? I mean, it's kind of perfect, guys. And a case of wine has 12, 12 bottles. 12 bottles. Oh. So we, 12 go, through, corks of we go through a the bottle an episode. Corks okay, of so right? I feel like we need I to do like this. I feel like we need to do this. So we now, just, just realizing <laughs> yes. that the three of us will drink 12 bottles of wine in the course of but a day. But that's only... Four no, bottles each. That is only four <laughs> bottles each. Okay, maybe that's not possible. I might die if I drank four bottles in a day. We'll, yeah. we'll but, do it over two days. <laughs> no, I think I th- I like the idea of marathoning the twelve yeah. days of drunk mess. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So I think and listeners, hopefully you can you can hold us accountable to this, but like that weekend before Christmas, mm-hmm. we need to sit down and we will have like like a, a full end. day and yeah. we will just po- we ha- we just have to find so many stories is really what it breaks I down think to. We well can do that. theoretically we need to find three times twelve, right? 12, 36 four, six, stories. Four times 12. 40. Yeah, I mean, we can stories. we can make some, like, part I don't of know. it can be look, a wrap-up. I'm not super popular at math, <laughs> so I don't know how many stories that is. Yeah. It's more than 10. Yep, exactly. Uh, that's a fact. All right, so that's my idea. <laughs> Hopefully by the I end of the it, years, yeah. we get to the 12 days of drunk miss. Plus, we have to come up with the song. Hour. On the 12th day, day of drunk miss, my true love gave to me. Alex and Allison gave to me. Ooh, I like that. Beer. Mm, it kind of it kind of petered out, but I like it. I like where, I like where you're going. Beer. <laughs> that's um. 
That's like a Canadian. The McKenzie Brothers. The McKenzie Brothers. Thank you. You know what I'm oh, talking was about. It? That's an actual song. Yeah. What is it? But what is it? It's, it's the 12 Days of remember. Canada Christmas or uh, something like that. A beer. But yeah, it's all yeah. like. Yeah. Oh, it's all the and whatever. I'm, anyway, that's my idea. Uh, How are I love you guys? that idea. I am good. Nice. I am about to sneeze like a motherfucker. Whoa, sneeze. Do it. Thanks for oh my gosh. <laughs> <us>. <laughs> now there's so much Wait. anticipation. It's going to happen. One away. One away. Oh. <laughs> yeah. And. I'm a very good sneezer. I actually can do a really good fake sneeze. Can you do a good fake sneeze? Um, shoo! No, that was okay, terrible. So I didn't like it. I didn't like it. What's right. your good fake sneeze? Here we go. <clears throat> Hold on. Let's see. I don't want to hurt the microphone right Yeah. <clears throat> or your face into the microphone is really Fake bad. sneeze, take one. <laughs> How great would that be if I fake sneeze, <laughs> hit my face on the microphone, and then passed out? <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. I would take so many pictures of you. Oh, wow. What's happening right now? <laughs> Oh, that was yeah, really good. That was really good. Uh, Mainly, I think it's the setup that you yeah, did, you which gotta, unfortunately you gotta, our listeners can't yeah, see. Gotta, there's a build. I'm glad you didn't sneeze, an actual sneeze in this like humid, cramped Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it garage. is so fucking hot. We it need is. to invent a silent air conditioner so we can do this. First off, every that needs yeah, to be a thing. Just, can that be a story that happens yeah. like in six months from yeah. now? We're going to be like, Let's, someone invented a silent air conditioner. Elon Musk needs to get on that. Stop the the super tube to San Francisco and <laughs> the super tube. silent air conditioners. <laughs> yeah. Oh God, um, that would be amazing. All right. It's so yes. Hot. How's everybody's week? It was fantastic. Anybody do anything fun and exciting? Um, I yeah, don't none of me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Good I story. Did. Same stuff. What's, what did you do, Tom? What did you get? Let's, you get let's hear your one sentence story. Yeah, I signed a big contract oh, for a big right. job, but I can't really talk about oh, it. But okay. I can say it's with Netflix. <clears throat> oh, yeah. and I'm head writing a show for them. Tom, that's well, fancy. Hello. Wait, you just said Thank you couldn't you. say the job, and, and then you, you just told said us the everything. Job. I can't give you the real details. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. So it's can not Netflix. <laughs> so, yeah, <laughs> right. Real details. You mean yeah. it wasn't anything like that? You're assassinating somebody on Tuesday. I wish that'd be a funner job. A funner job? Oh wow, Tom, you're on a roll. Yeah. Um. So that's what I did. Nice. That's cool. Congrats. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Nah, tell you more about it when, when does that about start? It. Oh. Next week. Ooh. I know something I did this week. Sorry, Tom. I totally <clears throat> oh, I, stole your go. thunder. I want to get sued. So <laughs> I played my first game of magic that wasn't uh, recorded for viewing. <laughs> you mean you played a game for pleasure? I played a game for pleasure, and it was so fun. It, it's Ooh. fun, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. It was great. And it, like... Now my friends and I are going to play magic like once a oh, week wow. together. Dude, <clears throat> when before we leave, okay. I have like a, so many magic. <gasps> Can I yeah. have your magic cards? Yes, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love how you're so excited. Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Gavin, if you're listening to this, you're going down. <laughs> yeah, it's. I was it's like cool. winning the game for like the. I had like literally twice as many uh, hit points as everyone else in the game. Yeah. And then my buddy Gavin pulled this like indestructible giant that was a twenty. 20, oh boy! And we couldn't fucking beat it. Dude, 20, Alex, do you 20. have a card that yeah. can beat that? Or I'm, however, I have works? to. I'll have to look into my magic bag. <laughs> oh, I can't and wait! Pull out <laughs> some sort of magic I can't card. Wait. The gold plated. I don't know how it works. But yeah, here's know. the thing. <laughs> the gold plated. I don't know. As robots, I don't know. I was already a super nerdy person, and now I'm just becoming nerdier. But it's good. <laughs> you, yeah, it's you're good just... when you're just like, you know what? If I'm gonna go all in, you know what I mean? Like, fuck it, I'm gonna try magic. I've just committed. Yeah, I've been playing D and D a lot. Nice. I'm like, yeah, fuck yeah, pen and paper yeah. RPGs. I love it. Pen and, and paper RPGs. So many video games. There's I mean, a lot of math in art in in D and D. I don't <clears throat> understand how you're good at it. Yeah, Alex. I. It, you know why? I literally. And this is totally true. I'll like roll the dice and I'll look at it, and look at the <laughs> set sheet, and I'll be like fourteen. 12. Wait, 7. <laughs> Would an 18 hit you? <laughs> it's just like, that's so just bad. Guess. It's just so bad. I'm like, generally in the 17 area, yeah. it's like, no, what's the number? And you're like, <laughs> this, One, that, two, uh, my AC, three. plus this, minus that. And then we, oh, we're really bad at like the rules. Like every just time wait, somebody- who do you play with? Um, Jerry, who doesn't talk to me. Jerry, who doesn't talk to you. Or listen to this podcast. Or listen to this podcast. <laughs> uh, my buddy Dan, he stopped because he got busy. Uh, Reza. Um, the rapper? The, the rapper Reza. Yeah. Amazing. My buddy Mikey. Wait, are you being serious? You're not being serious. No, not Reza oh. the rapper. <laughs> <clears throat> my buddy Reza. Um, and then uh, my buddy Jeff is the DM. Oh. Yeah. Jeff Kanata? Jeff Kanata. Oh, who's okay. an amazing DM, by the way. Really? Yeah, because oh, he's he super great. into voice, like oh, voice acting, I can see and because like, he's like one yeah. of those guys that like does all the different characters and the different voices, and oh, so that's much so fun. cool. Although we 
never have time to do it. Like we just don't, yeah. we can't schedule time. Is that to what do you it. guys did for Jeff's bachelor party? <clears throat> My bachelor party. Oh, for your bachelor party. You guys just yeah. like locked yourselves in a cabin we and played to, D&D yeah, all weekend, right? Lake, a lake cabin and played D&D. Yeah. Glad I was not invited to that <laughs> well, I didn't even party. know you back then. No. But I it was crazy because <laughs> Jeff literally wrote this like, it was all about our ba- my bachelor party. It was like an, oh, a D and D adventure that was like oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's I was off awesome. to get like the ring. Was of... Heather the bad guy? <laughs> no, <laughs> no. But there were these weird like <laughs> ghoulish bridesmaids that we had to fight. Oh, okay. And yeah, it was really it was really cool. Like that's your cool. actual wedding, I had yeah. to fight those ghoulish bridesmaids. Yeah. like the, the whole thing. I was like, this, oh, you yeah. yeah. It's crazy. No, in so reality, he had a photo booth, and I just made his buddy Jerry take a million photos with me in the photo booth. Everybody made Jerry take a million photos in the photo booth. I know. All right, let's read emails. <laughs> emails. Check, check out the emails. Check, check First the off, emails. got to email. Got to read the email from Ta- uh, Tim Watts. Even more free candy. Oh God! Because that's come on. What? Oh, it's got sketches. Is this? Is this an, uh, I don't even want to think about what it involves. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is box? Who am I? Who, okay, what go. am I? Uh, hey guys, just wanted to let you know how glad I am to be able to hear you on a regular basis again. Yay. I loved four points and was sad to see it go away. So were we. Yes. Um, That's why we created this podcast. Exactly. <laughs> I found it, wanted to find a way to say thanks, and since I do a little drawing now and then, I thought I would include a couple pieces that I what? did for you. Wonderful. For us? Hope you like them. Uh, also, I sent us? these a while back, uh, but don't know if you got them, which I, we did not. Oh. Um, wasn't sure what happened, but then I heard you talking about outdated email domains and realized I never responded because you were shitting on my YouTube, <laughs> Yahoo address. Amazing. What? No excuse. Love you guys, Tim. P.S. Sorry, I didn't get, uh, didn't do a pic of Tom. Couldn't find a good high res example there of him no online. There are no good pictures of me anywhere. Right, Thanks, so, anyways. I, I want to see. So here I want to see. Here is yeah. Allison Hayslip drawn. Oh, it's just me. <clears throat> I look like I'm a part of the Outsiders. I know. I like that. It's like that's a, really, really good. Yeah, and right? Then, that's yeah, a dude, for Pony me. Boy, man. That Alex is fantastic. <laughs> I Holy agree. Crap. Oh, my gosh. That is such a lifelike Alex. Thank They're you. both really good, but that one really yeah. okay. pops. Alex, here's the question. That's amazing. Amazing. Tim. Thank you, Tim. Good job, Fantastic. Man. Alex, you haven't changed our, our picture for the podcast yet. Oh, shoot, that's right. Alex took, and I specifically at Comic-Con took photos together in, in every all the photo, photo booths we could find. Just so we oh, could get been... a more current yeah. photo of us. Because the photo that is the, the picture for this podcast is literally the first time Alex and I ever met. And oh. I still oh, have that blonde is, hair. That is, right. that is yes. right. Yeah. That's so weird. Let me see if I can right. find the one. Here, this is the one that we're thinking well, about don't, using don't Tom. Don't bring it up now because, okay, we no, can show Tom. Tom didn't see it. Yeah. That's awesome. I love right? it. Right? Okay, That's good. great. So right. that needs to be. I see. Cute. Wicked cute. Yeah. I love it. Wicked cute. Okay, we're so hopefully cute. that'll wicked be our cute. new thing. Yeah, I or love the it. or the one, the blue one, or the blue one. I I kind of I I'm kind of have a preference. I'll mock them the... both up. I'll mock them both yeah. up. Yeah, the, you the listeners the are like, we have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, oh. Polsky, yeah, I smell Polsky. Tom, that's, that's the, the smartest <clears throat> thing you've ever said on the pro- show. That's the producer in me. Yeah, yeah, there you go. All right, so what's the Netflix producer? That head writer job is yours, sir. I have a preference to the blue one solely because I'm taking a drink in the blue picture. You guys all understand what you said. Drink makes sense. I am. What do you mean? It just sounded like you were leading up to taking a shit, taking a. That's I'm taking. Whatever. Yeah, actually, why did I say taking a drink? That's weird. I'm yeah. drinking a drink. I don't know what I taking take a, drink a drink means. Take was a it a shun? vodka drink? Take a swig it was, or a whiskey drink? It was absolutely a vodka drink. Don't you remember Friday night? It was all vodka drinks that <laughs> I love night my vodka. at Comic-Con. That's right. We got, I got lit up, man. Yeah, I did too. I you woke up really Saturday up. and I was like, thanks, Alex. I mean, we, I'm just saying. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> I was drunk, but Hayslip, you were like fucking wasted. <laughs> no. <laughs> I just remember we went into the last party and your buddy was like, uh, you should have some water. Oh, Zach. Zach. <laughs> yeah, was like, I, we walk into the Nerd HQ party and I see Zach Levi and I'm like, Zach. And Zach looks at me. He's like, you need to drink you a bottle of water. water. <laughs> and I was like, fuck you, Judgy McJudgerson. I'm just fine. And then I went to the bar and I was like, I should drink a bottle of water because Zach told me to. And then the next morning I woke up and I was like, Thank God, Zach told me to drink a yeah. bottle of water. Oh yeah, wow. <laughs> yeah, it was hysterical. Because literally, told him the first we walked day. in, we're like, "What's up?" And he was like, "Hey, hey you need water." Yeah, and I was like, mm, "That's very astute." That's, that's how long Zach has known me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he can he tell. Feel, yeah, he can, he can tell, tell when I am too drunk for my own good. All right, Corey Lawrence oh, uh, Corey. emailed Corey us. Corey emails us a lot. He does. Uh, I could be wrong, but is the subject. Ooh, I know. Ooh. Very interesting. I was taught in medical school Ooh. that stat means sooner. Than already there. 
My medical training was in massage therapy school, mind you. <laughs> <laughs> I have a feeling. Okay, I'm I have a guess. feeling that might be the shorthand that people just have made say. it. Yeah, because yeah. let's be honest, <laughs> no one would actually think up sooner, sooner than, than already there. there. But I like that. That's kind of what. Hey, my shoulders massage. Stat. Stat. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my god, my hamstring. Get a masseuse over here. Stat. <laughs> Where's that massage I mean, therapist? Stat, stat is really just shorter than immediately. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Yeah. That takes a long time to say. Immediately. Yeah. Immediately. Yeah. Stat. stat. There's a lot to of now. You can say stat. now. Why now. Not now. 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 Yeah, that, that, is, now. that is a good point. Nah. Oh my gosh, Alex, my headphones fucking cut out again. But what? I can hear you. That's fresh. I mean, it's fresh. <laughs> fresh tape. <laughs> free puppy hugs. Free you puppy hugs. Uh oh. Free puppy. Alex, <laughs> I love this from Jeremy. <laughs> Jeremy oh, no. Burton. Hi, Allison and Alex. Fuck you, Tom. Thank you. <laughs> robots Robots have become self-aware. Shit. Eat, eat a bag of dick, Tom. <laughs> what? Is that my mom? Wait, who is <laughs> this that? person? Jeremy? I was like, you must know this guy. <laughs> What's his name? I don't know. Jeremy Barton. That's oh. fucking hysterical. Eat a bag of dick, Tom. <laughs> yeah, was and it was a hashtag. It was hashtag eat a bag of dick, Tom. Oh, it was hashtag oh, eat a bag God. of dick, oh, Tom. Poor first. Tom. Oh, That's boy. hilarious. That is hilarious. Dude, Thank my you. first, I will say, I and mean, I although this is all, in, that was clearly in jest, <laughs> but my first email, I've said the story so many times, my first fan mail that I ever got when I got the job hosting the screensavers, yeah. I sit down at my computer, I'm like, yeah, I got this new job, and I got an email and account, and it's so great, and my first email was, Alex Albrecht should fucking die. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. And I was like, wait a minute. What? And I hadn't even hosted yeah. anything. Like, nobody oh, knew anything about me. And it gosh. literally, I was like, that was the best thing that could ever happen. Because I was like, nothing that I get yes, from now on be that has bad. anything to do with me. Oh, you know what I mean? Oh, my gosh. That's funny. Uh, well, thank that. you. I will eat that <laughs> yeah. bag. He was like, hey. By the way, can you just imagine a bag of dicks? Like, I don't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> why but, is it here? Way, <laughs> let's just imagine. Why is this bag? Of, who left this bag of dicks and here? And then to eat it. I know. Uh, you're like, I'm really hungry. Uh, hey, there's this bag of dicks over here. <laughs> well, why are they there? What What made these discarded dicks say in the bag? <laughs> yeah. Tom should eat them. Tom, <laughs> Tom should eat them. I got an idea. Uh, all right. This is from Johnny Holt. Uh, I love the show is the subject. Thanks, Johnny. Holt. Allison, Alex, and Tom. Yes. Uh, since seeing you guys at Comic Con <gasps> and discovering the Half Hour Happy Hour. Oh, he discovered us at Half Hour at, at Comic Con. That's crazy. Yes. My apologies. I'm it late worked. to the podcast and game. Don't worry about it. It's all good. I've now downloaded and listened to every single episode. Oh, wow. yes. Thank you for so many, many laughs while I'm, uh, I get in my fledgling PR business off the ground. Oh, that's oh, cool. How cool. And search for uh, Madly for a day job. Uh, the live podcasting was so much fun and one of my highlights of my San Diego Comic Con 2015 experience. We're a highlight. Dude, that's awesome. That's so great. I just love that that guy wasn't, he didn't know the show. Like he would just yeah. like wander by and then listen to every episode. Yeah, that's, that's amazing. Thanks, man. It plus worked. One to, plus one to listeners. Yeah. Uh, I really just wanted to say hi and thanks. It isn't cool that we made it to Pluto, which is awesome. We the did. story below notes the trajectory designer Yang Ping was. Only about 70 seconds off of her initial estimate of reaching Pluto. Wow. 70 seconds. Wow. That's awesome. This would be like, we'll be there mm, because nine it's been, years. Because it's been out there. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Nine years, six days, four wing things, seconds, and 36 seconds. Also, so shout out to the fact that she's a woman engineer. We need what more. I love my women engineers. Get, get into it, so, ladies. So we were 70 seconds late. Yeah, oh. or maybe seventy seconds early. Ooh. We were just oh, yeah. off by seventy seconds. Yep. And he calls himself a she the calls herself right. a scientist. Sorry. Come on, <laughs> uh, keep up the amazing work. I will keep listening. In the meantime, my wife and I are hoping to design a T-shirt that says "I'm super super popular at spreadsheets," <laughs> uh, yeah. and "I'm super popular at literature." Me. Brilliant. Oh, yes. that's so nice. Uh, if you do another live taping, I'll volunteer to bring the wine so Tom can focus on his sidekick duties. <laughs> Amazing. Aww. Thank you. But don't Amazing. bring a bag of dicks. Bring the wine. <laughs> okay, yeah. <laughs> Thank By you. the way, somebody will show up with a the, with the bag of dicks. <laughs> and be like, you got a bag of dicks. <laughs> I, somebody told me I was supposed to do this. By the way, a bag of dicks could just be like hot dogs, and we could yeah. be like, here, eat a bag That's of dicks. Meaners. I was thinking it was more like a bunch of like pictures of Richard Branson. Oh, my gosh. Funny. Or Dick but Tracy. It, yeah. Like a bag yeah, a of Dick of Tracy things. things. Or like Richard Burton, or any dick will do. Richard, <laughs> any, any, any dick will yeah. do. That's Tom's new porn. Richard title Nixon. Name. Richard Dixon. Richard. Yeah, uh, Just, uh, porn. No, names. Richard Nixon, not Richard. Di what? Here we yeah, go. Porn he knows presidents. Yeah. It's from Brian. It's from Wait, Brian. 
Brian, hey guys, Brian, Brian, stuck uh, on a plane. plane I don't in think Japan? I don't think stuck on a plane. Plane, Brian. Oh, okay. Uh, Just porn another names, Brian. Four points. Wrecking ball. Uh, hey guys, especially what? Alex, as it oh. seems he doesn't get as much love as the rest. Oh, thank you, Brian. <laughs> Totally now, deserve. I feel better about myself. <laughs> yeah, right. Wait, Alex gets love. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Let's be honest. Tom's love consists of eat a bag of dicks. So. Yeah, right. Exactly. <laughs> but he still gets email. That's fan mail, in my opinion. <laughs> true, true, true. Uh, all right. Love the show. I've been missing Alex and Allison's uh, shooting the shit together since you time hosting four points. Yeah. Awesome show, by the way. But I digress. Uh, your oh, SDCC nice. special was uh, amazing. Uh, but I feel Fuck you yeah, missed you missed a trick when oh. talking about the porn titles when Tom seemingly without context said save some of my save some for my wife yeah <laughs> a <laughs> definitive oh. triple X title if I ever heard one I so love as it. we were talking, right. I was drinking all the wine yeah. and you were like save, save some, some for save my some wife save some for my wife totally a porn <laughs> title <laughs> she, that is that is nice fantastic. job Brian that's like on another level porn <laughs> title like that's yeah. got. The plot in it, yes. You know what I mean, like and the guilt. guilt, and the guilt. Weird, like <laughs> I want you to bang my wife, like just yeah. weird shit. That's amazing. Save That's awesome. My, oh. Uh, oh, nice. Oh, and thanks up. for all the awesome content. And Allison, your version of Wrecking Ball was by far the best I've heard. Oh, thank you, my buddy John uh, Bobak, and I did a did an acoustic cover of Miley Cyrus's Wrecking Ball. Which, yeah, you think Miley Cyrus's Wrecking Ball? Why would you cover that song? But then, as soon as you covered acoustically, you're like, oh, this is kind of an awesome song. <laughs> That's so, amazing. Check yeah. it out on my YouTube channel. <clears throat> Just. Google Allison Hazel Breaking Ball. I'm sure it'll come I up. love this, by the way. P.S. Now I've started muttering, I'm super popular at math yeah. at random intervals, and friends I'm of mine are wondering. Super why popular at math. Oh my gosh. British six foot something bearded knife maker is occasionally talking like a teenage American girl. Ryan makes knives? What? By the way, we love knives. We Whoa. need, <laughs> we got to figure out what is the half hour happy hour with Allison and Alex knife look like yes brian inform us yeah let us and know by the way you're super popular at knives <laughs> and super popular you at knives. yeah just go I'm super popular at knives um, guys alex i feel like there was an email that we looked at last week that not on the show that we were supposed to bring up again this week oh, yeah mm-hmm. we mm-hmm. yeah I, I told you to mark it as unread so go into the inbox and find it i'm guessing alex didn't want there's a to whole read. bunch of unread that one that solo one this solo cup yeah the so- red solo <clears throat> cup I fill you up. Let's have a party. But I, Tom, thank you for being on my side with that song. Alex has no idea. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, Matt yeah, yeah. Mason. Oh, Matt Mason. Matt yeah, because Matt Mason, Sergeant Matt Mason, right? Yes. Or Captain Matt Mason. Oh, this is what we want to figure out for you guys. Out. Okay, yes. okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay listeners, okay, 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 we need okay, you. Okay. Okay, okay. Alex. They fuck you with the cell phones. Uh, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Listeners, we need you on this one. Okay. Uh, I like this. It, the way it starts is fantastic. Alice to Allison, Alex, and Tom, or as I sometimes refer to you three as the only good thing about Mondays. Oh, Sweet. we are. Yeah, thanks. It's fucking hot. Garfield would have liked us. <laughs> By the way, Tom is literally fanning himself with the instruction manual for the recorder we're recording on. Actually, that's a it's a yard. Device. It is so it's the yard. It's the weed whacker that I now <laughs> will never use again. <laughs> Fuck you, it hornets. Summons hornets. Fuck apparently. you, hornets. Brooming, brooming, brooming. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Uh, Matt Mason. So, you see, my name is Matt Mason. Kudos if you already know what the name means, but I can tell you if it, it was a big, it was all a coincidence. My parents had no idea of the significance of that name until taking me to my first San Diego Comic Con. Okay, about I feel 20 like we need ago. to abbreviate this story, Alex. I'm, I'm, I am abbreviating. Yeah, 25 oh, okay. minutes. So. Oh, Jesus, really? All right. So anyway, so everybody at the Comic Con had this reaction. Oh, Matt Mason, crazy! Did they were they big Matt Mason fans? Okay, I'm going to shorten this story for you. This guy's name is Matt Mason. He didn't realize that there were actually action figures out there. There's yeah. a Sergeant Matt Mason. Major, major. Sorry, Major Matt Mason. That mm-hmm. makes sense. Alliteration. Got it. Um, it was made by Mattel back in 1966. By, there we go. And he's looking for one. He and wants one. And he can't find them anywhere. So if any of our listeners have one or have access to one. Or know the, or know the toy hunter guy. Yep. Yes. Uh, or and know he the said, toy hunter guy. He said, yeah. I can provide a copy of my driver's license or anything else to prove that this is my actual <laughs> given name. Yes. Yeah, send that to us. Does he say, <laughs> yeah, does he he say that we can it. give... Yeah, I'm sure he wants to buy it. He didn't. He doesn't have his his uh, address his or contact. anything. Yet. Okay, so here's the deal: if any of the listeners out there have it or have access to it or we somehow will, we can email you. us and we will connect you guys. Yes, because half hour happy hour fans at gmail.com. There we go. Email Boom. us. Brilliant. Because Let's it would be it. awesome if this podcast actually united this man <laughs> with his namesake toy. I love it. 
I yes. love it. All right, now we're we're super long on we're super popular at length. Yes. Uh, so let's... so is all my ex boyfriends. Hey. <laughs> I was wondering when something like that was going to come out. Uh, <laughs> uh, that's why I'm single. We just saw Crazy Allison. She's like, <laughs> <laughs> let's get to a all story. Right. Let's get to it. We're super popular with stories. First off, fuck this story. Uh-oh. I'm so excited about this story. Sweet. Wait, then so why, why are you fuck going it? to fuck it? Is, it? This story is like, what the fuck? What? Okay. okay. So check this shit out. I'm checking it out, okay. Alex, as soon as you, you read it. There is a already. town. There in, was a town. There's a town. There is currently a town in Kazakhstan. In Kazakhstan? Kazakhstan. Okay. Right? This chick was in a market, <clears throat> and uh, she went up to the stall, and she got like woozy, like they, she couldn't figure it out. She got woozy. She fucking fell asleep. Like in the market. Fell asleep in the market. Okay. Four days she's asleep. What? Four days. She wakes up. She can't, it feels like her legs aren't her own legs. What? She can't really walk. They take her to the hospital. They were like, we think you might Wait, have had Wait, where did a- she wake up? She woke, fuck, I don't know. She woke up. Okay. Uh, while shoppers were still yeah, <laughs> shopping right? around her after four days. So they take her to the hospital and we think you had a, a, you know, like a seizure or something, like yeah. a stroke or something. She's like, oh, fuck, that sucks. Okay, cool. Whatever. Blah, 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 blah. Two weeks later, falls asleep again. No. Full on snoring. Like okay. Like four days. Another four days. What? Goes back to the hospital. Can't figure it out. Everybody's like, well, man, it sucks to be that chick. Like, that really sucks. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Month later. What? One of the nurses that was working with her. Yeah. Falls asleep. <gasps> yeah. Four days. Five Four days. Four days? Can't what? figure out what's going on. Right? Everybody's yeah. like, holy shit. So they start like getting all freaked out and trying to figure out like, what the fuck yeah, is, is this going like, on. Is this contagious? Yeah. 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 Nobody can know. Nobody knows. You know, it's all this stuff. And everybody's like, well, it sucks. You know, I mean, there's these two people, you know, whatever. So then they're doing a town party. There's like a town party. <laughs> Everybody at the party. Falls asleep? Falls asleep. <laughs> Shut up. They fall asleep. And they're like semi in and out of consciousness. And it all starts with Alex, them like slurring their speech. We talk about true Whoa. stories on this show, yes. not sci-fi novels. <laughs> yeah. What are you doing? It's an episode of Fringe. True story. It is literally called The Town That Falls Asleep. Yeah. Okay. What? Okay. Is there the, an answer? A, a week in the mysterious sleeping village of wow. Kazakhstan. They have no fucking idea what it is. Really? Wait a minute. They have no idea. They haven't solved no, this? No, no. They have. So all these scientists went and they were like, we got to figure they this shit asleep. out. Yeah, <laughs> that yeah, they fell asleep. Yeah, they fell That girl is fucking patient zero. Yeah, 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 yeah. Test yeah. her for shit. Yeah. yeah. They couldn't figure it out. Wow. They thought at first it was because of a uranium mine, that, uh, like a Russian yeah. uranium mine. No, it's not. They checked it. Mine's cool. But when they wake up, do they feel really relaxed? They and don't remember anything but that happened over the course of the time that they were asleep. How do you sleep for four fucking days? You can, they, do you piss someone, yourself? No, you can get woken up. Oh, yeah. they, they, you can. They wake up. Like you can wake them up, and they'll go to the bath. Like it's basically like taking a sleeping pill it's on like the plane. A, it's like a mono or something. Yeah, it's like where you wake up and you go in, you take a piss, you go back to bed, and you don't even really remember that you did that. Yeah. Some of and then this one kid get gets fucking super agitated and fucking just starts running. They actually have to tie him down what? when he goes through these events because he basically is like fucking bolt, like literally just starts running. No, yeah. what? Yeah, fucking Kazakhstan. What? Okay, yes. Note yourself, don't go to Kazakhstan anytime soon. Well, don't go to the sleeping village in Kazakhstan unless <laughs> yeah. you're really tired. <laughs> dude. Yeah, you mean unless you have an insomnia. Dude, you mean. this you... is how the zombie apocalypse Right, starts. but how crazy is that that yeah. it's like this weird story? In like nine months, we're going to be sitting here being like, so remember that story we did nine months ago? That was Patient Zero. It wasn't Who so funny. Yeah. Yeah, it's not so funny. <laughs> no, and they're... by the way, we'll be back after these sleeping messages. <laughs> yes. Also, Four we're days. locked in a bunker together. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no doubt. Yeah. I like well, we How still be doing that, this though? from a bunker. Oh, yeah. I would, yeah. We got to get, <laughs> so we gotta get it. We got to get it out. It'll become yeah. the half hour, happy hour of freedom. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just be the, the people who are broadcasted over like the, uh, the <laughs> yeah, AM the USO stations. stuff or whatever. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah it's yeah. like. <laughs> <sighs> Welcome to hour 75. <laughs> uh, the half hour, happy really hour. need that wine from yeah. that Canadian woman. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We're on to our last bottle of wine and our Canadian a wine. bag of Cheez-Its. Uh, <laughs> blah. <laughs> so many Cheez-Its. Uh. I hate Cheez-Its. I hope you don't like Cheez-Its? No, Cheez-its I hope when the, the apocalypse pop. hits, that's not Cheez-its. the only food I get to eat. I love Cheez-Its. I hate white Cheez-Its. But I'm nips. a racist you when like it comes nips? to Cheez-Its. Still do <laughs> nips? Do they still make nips? Those are like the other Cheez Its. Yeah, I like them. They're okay. They're like che- chintzy Cheez Its. So you don't like nips? I don't like. I, yeah, right. I'm okay with Doritos. Love Doritos. Get Dorito, salty dude. though, but good. Doritos are good. Yeah. Doritos are. I good like that you science. said Doritos are salty, like Cheetos aren't. 
Well, cheese it. Cheez it. But Cheetos, oh, yes. Wait, cheese. Oh, yeah, we're talking about cheese. The little squares of cheese. Oh, I'm an asshole. I totally love cheese. It's there you go. I, was, I knew dear there was something wrong. Send us snacks to eat while we're drinking yeah. wine. Yeah, dear Cheez Its. I ate a bag of Cheez Its two days ago. I totally love Cheez Its. Right, By the way, that's a that's a shirt. I ate a bag of Cheez Its two days ago. I ate a bag of Cheez Its. Anyway, crazy. Okay. Crazy. Crazy Kazakhstan. Hope they figure that out. You know what? So I don't follow Kazakhstan is selfishly. fucking crazy. Kazakhstan is super popular at sleeping. Yeah, <laughs> Kazakhstan is super popular. Super popular at sleeping. Like, they'll sleep for like four days without even wanting to. I mean, that's like a true story. That is so Kazakhstan. That's, fall asleep. That's so Kazakhstan. <laughs> yeah. Oh my hey, God. Hey, wake up, Kazakhstan. <laughs> <laughs> All right, next. <laughs> this one's awesome. We talked okay, about Pluto sweet. last time. We totally did talk about Pluto. We got to talk time. about this. Okay. I mean, mind blown. Okay. We have found mm-hmm. a second Earth. Yes, it's like our older cousin. Yeah, yeah. Kepler four five two B. Can we just call it Earth two? Kepler. It is in, in my ma- in my yeah. mind. Earth it's two. Earth two. Or is it like? But they found it. Goldilocks. Birth. Like birth. Beta, beta Earth. Birth. <laughs> hey, uh, where are you guys gonna go on vacation? Oh, we're thinking about going to birth. 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 <laughs> Oh, you mean second Earth? <laughs> it's called birth. It's called birth. Uh, this birth. one's Earth. That one's birth. Yeah. It's sort of like the slightly touched older brother <laughs> of Earth. Who's like, hey, come to birth, guys. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, so birth. We found birth. It is 1,400 light years away. That's a lot of light years. <clears throat> it's like super popular light years. Yes. <laughs> so far I mean, away. Think about light traveling for a year. And then doing it for 1,400 of them. Of them. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's the things where you start to realize, like, look, if we're going to do something, if we're going to go there, although then you get we to We need that, warp speed. We either that. need warp speed or, or black hole. Light speed. Warm, or wormhole. Wormholes. Worm I mean, hole. wormholes is really the great way, you know, stargate yeah. that shit. Yeah. Uh, but, you know, the other thing, too, though, you got to realize is um, there's a world in which you make a spaceship whose job it is is to travel for thousands of years. Yeah. And then you're sort of like. Who wants to? Be, I mean, it sucks. Just, to be it's not born just like nine like, yeah. years to no. Pluto. No, no, it's yeah. There's no round trip on that yeah. shit. That's mind but, boggling. But you could get there and be like, "Ha, there's no oxygen." <laughs> Bam. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, no, but isn't that what they figured out? That that's why it's a cousin because it has all the shit. That well, they didn't know. It, it's, it's just in the space. Oh, yeah, they don't know what the actual the composition right. of the. Planet. It could be like the fucking wave planet in Interstellar. Where they're like, oh, it's all. Yeah, maybe. Uh, thanks for ruining it for me. Oh Wave my gosh, planet. I forgot I don't, I don't about know. the fact that you fuckers haven't seen Interstellar. It's om- once it comes to HBO, I will watch the shit. <laughs> once it comes to HBO, you should have seen pay- it in IMAX. I know, I just but then I missed the window, and then it was like it's playing at this one weird theater that's like a postage stamp. It's uh, not where you want to see it. Uh, yes, so, that's how I felt. Yeah. Oh my so gosh. this planet, so it doesn't do anything for us because we can never get there. Well, no, so we, what's we the can point? only never get there now. Yeah, in the that future, maybe Still. we can travel in the... That yeah. made so much sense. Well, but no, I but love now, that. We can only never get there now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's a shirt. Yeah, we can only never get there now. Oh, I love that yeah. shirt. But so I, I absolutely want to wear that shirt. Because yeah. people would never. like read it and be like, what? And then and I'd be like, like yeah. Earth too, And they'd be like, yeah, okay, got it. And they'd be like, mm-hmm. Or you could just have a picture of like Earth's second cousin. I don't know, whatever. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> This basically Actually, is Earth's honestly, that, second that cousin once is, removed. That phrase is oddly deep in life. Like, think about it not applying to planets. Just be like, you can only never get there now. Yeah. But Whoa. in the future, you can fucking get there. Yeah. So we're keep trying. Yeah. yeah. Reebok. Yeah. <laughs> <We're> n- <laughs> but, so fucking keep trying. <laughs> Reebok. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Carl's Jr. Dude, yeah, Carl's that, that's going to become, dude, that is going to absolutely become one of those, like, Instagram inspirational quotes that gets post, yeah. like, passed around. And yeah. we're going to be like, um, Alex Albrecht came up with yeah. that. Yeah, Fuckers. I'll be like, P.S. Alex Albrecht. Yeah, P.S. 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 Stands Copyright for, Alex P.S. Albrecht. P.S. stands for, I fucking said that. Yeah. <laughs> Postscript. Postscript I said, fucking that, said that shit. Uh, but anyway, how cool is that? So we got to figure out, but now they're going to start f- focusing on it and try to figure out composition of it. If there's potentially water, there could potentially, I mean, we are now, we have now seen with the Kepler telescope. Yep. I guess we haven't seen it because we saw the the light of the star dimming enough to know the how that far around it and there. all that shit. So we were not yeah. really actually looking at it. Right? No, we weren't. It's kind of far. <laughs> yeah, science. I mean, it's fourteen hundred light years. Science. science, 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 science. Okay, okay. Still, anyway, but but that's it, a big deal. It'll never not ha- Here's help the, us now. It'll never not happen. I, I mean, the bigger deal is: are there people on it? 
Well, yeah. Ooh, that's what they were saying, that there might be but this life is, on there. This is the craziest so... part. So this is what... That would freak me the fuck out, by the way. I did, that just occurred really? to me. If there was another planet with like humanoids on it, yeah. like us... I would actually kind of like lose my shit. I'd be like, you I guys think a have lot a of New people York would too? lose your shit. <laughs> you guys have uh, a New York uh, too? Think, Is that what yeah, you just yes, said? Exa- that's what I mean. Do you have that like, Kazakhstan where people fall asleep? No, no, no. <laughs> it's, it's way more, it's, it's way more easier for me to, way more easy? Yeah. Way more easy for me to grasp the concept of aliens, mm. but of there being other humans somewhere. So like if you freaky. met, if you met like a Romulan or a Vulcan, that basically was just humans with like a little tweak on their aesthetics. Uh, a cheap tweak. Yeah, a cheap yeah, tweak yeah. on their aesthetics. Yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? But like if there was a whole other planet with just like people doing podcasts like we are. Oh, that you would... mean like an actual like mirror world? Yeah, 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 yeah. Where they're just like, how crazy would it be? We found this other thing called. I mean, that was a movie. Called but Bepler like... 77. Yeah. And they were like, and they're like, let's call it Earth, <laughs> because you kind of feel like, do, do, is it your concept of like aliens? Like one, they don't really look like us, yeah. but two, it's like their entire society is based on like exploring Clicks space, and yeah, like yeah, being yeah, yeah. At, like you don't think of them having like home lives, yeah, and like raising children or something like that, or spores, whatever they yeah. use. <laughs> Or entertainment, or yeah, sports. yeah, like they're doing e- they alien raise. dancing. You know what I mean? Like, I just love alien Eating music. alien food. That's so weird. Yeah. It's so weird. Cooking. What are they cooking? Like, just think of aliens cooking. Oh my god, so weird. I'm like kind of freaked out about thinking about there being another Earth. Yeah, that was the name of that movie, Another Earth, where like a second Earth popped up and like, but that had the same people on it. I think. Yeah, I but wasn't that movie. like? Was it? Oh, an, yeah, Another Earth. I think it was called. Yeah, Titan also. AE? No, 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 no. That was after also Earth. another one. There was After Earth. Oh, right. Titan After Earth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But that yeah. was an Earth discovering device. Yeah. Anyway, long story longer. Um, <laughs> I just love this quote from uh, from NASA, which I thought was like crazy. Of course you do, because uh, your dad totally ran NASA. Exo- exoplanets, especially small Earth-sized worlds, yeah. belonged within the realm of science fiction just 21 years ago. Today, and thousands of discoveries later, astronomers are on the cusp of finding something people have dreamed about for thousands of years, Whoa. another Earth. Another Earth, see? Crazy. Yeah. Crazy! Science crazy. fiction shit. Science fiction shit is happening, people. I love it. Me too. I yeah, love they, it. they never predicted podcasts back in the day, did they? I'm sure somebody was like, <laughs> and these idiots will sit in their garage and record their voices for all to hear. And they'll talk about things that don't matter and stuff. Yes. And they'll laugh and sweat. And six people will <laughs> listen to them. Six people will listen. And those six people shall email them. Nah, that's crazy. And That'll say never happen. That's Get crazy. out of here, you crazy nut. <laughs> yeah. Go back into your science hole, caveman. Science hole. <laughs> caveman. Yeah, why does a caveman get a science hole? It's it's because the guy's so stupid. He doesn't know what to say. Story. Can oh. make, all right. I, can, I can make save caveman. All right, next science. story. How many how many minutes you're, are we in? You're, about, you're fine. Just do one more. Okay, one more. Don't tell us what to do, Tom. Just do two more. This isn't your show, two Tom. More. Don't do anything. All right, oh, we'll there do we one more. It has to do with space, so we're sort of on the topic. Returning to the moon is ten times cheaper than thought. I'm sorry. What? And <laughs> it could lead to Mars. So we were like, uh, the United States government was like, well, we're not going back to the moon. It's, it's co- t- cost too much. They like ran the numbers and they were like, it's $100 billion oh, to go back to the moon. You're right, Tom. Then they thought. Yeah. I was like, it's <clears throat> cheaper to, th- to go- send someone to the, move th- to the moon than to think? Like that. Yeah. Didn't- ah. <laughs> yeah. They didn't have the yeah. they in here. No, exactly. But it should be in there. Yeah. And I don't know who the global they is, but the global they is yeah. the people who ever thought, thought about NASA it. NASA thought, something yeah. Like that. So they said it was going to be like $100 billion to, to get the moon landing program back up and running okay. and get a sustainable um, moon base. Basically a fucking moon base, which I've been talking about for years. Just make a moon base. Yeah. It would be awesome. You could sell tickets. I would fucking go to a moon base, right? Yeah. So now this company did the study. Remember, we're gonna do our podcast from the moon. Yeah, podcast uh, from the fucking yeah. moon. Yeah, right. moon Seriously. base. Come on, we'll bring. So we can bring reason. the recorder. It's portable and the wine. That can and travel, the wine. Right? Wine will be there. I want March oh, yeah. or moon wine. Moon wine. Moon wine. Moonshine wine. Moonshine wine. Uh, Brilliant. Uh, writes itself. We're gonna make so much money <laughs> once we get that moon base thing squared away. We're gonna make so much money. Just ship. It's gonna be super cheap to ship stuff back from the moon. You know, 
No, yeah. it's not, gonna, it'll <laughs> not at all. Send grapes to the moon. Also, I'm sure you can't ferment shit. I'm sure there's yeah. like lots of problems with physics and stuff like that. Yeah, you're like, oh, it's good. It causes a lot of cancer, but it tastes great. <laughs> anyway, no, more like stuff probably explodes. Yeah, stuff probably, probably explodes. it's out yeah. of space. It's out of space. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah. You know what? Pioneers. You got. You got. You got to lose a little flesh <laughs> to make some wine. <laughs> it's horrible. What? Uh, anyway, that is not a shirt. So they, that you got to lose. You know a what? Flesh. I'm not going to let that be a shirt. <laughs> I don't think that should be a shirt. He uses a lot of flesh to make some wine. That's terrible. <laughs> it is terrible. Uh, I hate that shirt. It's not a shirt. We're not going to make the shirt. It better not be a shirt. We'll never make that shirt. Fuck that shirt. Somebody's going to show up with that shirt just because you're ah! Uh But so they basically, they were like, when you can get other people like actually put out, like companies can actually get involved, they can lower the cost because they want to be, yeah. you know, involved in doing they, it. They want to have sponsorship. And they They're said- They're going to have like the MetLife moon base. Exactly. Really what it's going to be. Yeah. <laughs> The AIG Moon Lander. Yeah. Tropicana Moon Juice. Tunnel. <laughs> tunnel. <laughs> Tropicana. Hmm. Hey, Tropicana's interested in uh, owning this tunnel. Where does it go? I don't know. We just built a tunnel so it's Tropicana tunnel. can have it's it. It's a tunnel from the moon to Earth. It's like the tunnel that they're going to Right? Interesting. Wow. We're going to build a tunnel from San Francisco yeah. to LA. Yeah. Just build a tunnel yeah, from Earth to the moon. Straight up. Yeah. Well, the crazy thing Duh. is they think that they can actually be making, um, what was it, 200 pounds? 200 billion pounds. Wait, hold on. Wait, are you talking pounds like British money or pounds no, like... No, 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 no. They said it'll take only $4 billion uh, to make the thing. Where's the fucking... That's gap? a lot Four of... $4 billion, billion to make the... To do the whole thing. Get us up there, make the moon base. Okay, I guess Everything's in, cool, in, yeah. flights. So Bill but Gates crazy could fund is, this whole thing. Exactly, yeah. yeah, that's what I'm talking about. But so here's Come the on, crazy Bill thing. Gates. Yeah. The study says that a manned base on the moon could produce... 200 million tons of spacecraft propellant per year. What? They could make they could make, make rocket their own gasoline, gas, gasoline to... which means it'll become even cheaper and easier to go to Mars because you don't have to bring uh, it with you. You don't have to bring it with there. you. It's like, it's hey, I'm station. going, but first thing I'm going to do is yeah. stop at the gas station because 99 percent yeah. of I the mean... accelerant that we use in space. Uh, spacecraft is to break our atmosphere. Atmosphere that makes a lot of sense, huh. but also Which is are why we the, just turning the moon into a glorified gas station? It's a big, uh, it's and kind of a dick the thing answer to do. Is yes, big yeah. circle K. Oh my god! Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! How great would that be if there was the literally like a circle K and you like <laughs> look up and it's just a circle K spinning? Holy shit! <laughs> and they're like Dunkin' Donuts up there. Yes. Come pick up your cheese. It's for the long haul to Mars. <laughs> yeah, I oh want this to happen god. so bad. I want I, it to be a truck stop. I want to go to the moon and get like an omelet. You know what I mean? And then like, go to Mars. Like a moon omelet. A moon, moon omelet. omelet. By and the then way, just go you back. wouldn't get an omelet at a gas station. Why would you get one? Oh, on, on the moon, stop. you would. Truck stop. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Truck stops, dude. Hash browns. Only if they have like an IHOP attached to them. No, no I, like, I like a true diver, truck yeah, stop. The divery stuff. Yeah, I got like this crazy. Uh, Alex and I are scrapple. Like that. Scrapple. Have you guys oh, had scrapple before? Heard of it. No, because oh. I don't eat fucking eggs. Well, scrapple's not eggs. Jesus. And by the way, it, like, why don't you eat eggs, communist? What's wrong with what's wrong with chicken butt? Uh, chicken butt? Well, that's where the eggs come out of, right? <laughs> no. Oh, chicken vajazzle. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with chicken vajazzle. Eat the fucking chicken. I'm just not going to eat the egg. Why? What's wrong? Because it's gross. Eggs are gross. I don't think. I think we've all been lied to about eggs. I think if people really thought about the taste of eggs, everyone would be like, "Oh shit! Why have I been eating this?" Big fan of the yolks. Dipping my uh, my toast Ew. in my yolks. Big I fan of the yolks. <laughs> Dipping my toast in those yolks. <laughs> Do you do the soft boiled eggs, French style? Oh. I don't even know. I just make eggs, uh, <laughs> fried eggs, scrambled eggs. I like fried eggs. I eat two two eggs a mor- every Me morning. Too. Yeah, get the hell out of here. I eat no eggs every day. Uh, <laughs> That's you a can't set. not. By eat the way, eggs. do you eat mayonnaise? <laughs> mayonnaise. Some, I understand that eggs are in things, and I'm fine with that. Like obviously, I eat cake. <laughs> Okay. You eat cake? Yeah. yeah obviously. I thought you didn't like eggs. Burn. No, I don't like eggs on their own. <laughs> Hypocrite. Uh, so I'm not uh, going to go to the moon and have fucking eggs. But okay, you're we're not really going to make it. We're not going to eat the look, eggs. Relax. You said you had to eat <laughs> eggs on the moon. <laughs> we're just telling you they're there. And by the way, Scrapple is great. It's just weird parts of the pigs. Oh, mix it's up. like a more of a bacon y thing. Yeah. yeah, it's like a hash I'd actually hot probably dog, bacon but thing. Not in the dog form. I don't know what it's. It's weird. It's like all the. It's basically yeah. It's like a hot dog that's just then like mixed in with it's, hash browns. It's really good. It's great right. hangover food. Someone send a scrapple. Uh, scrapple is great more, hangover food. More, if you want. What time? What, how much time we got? Forty five. Oh, we wasted no. the first two minutes. No, no, yeah, we should not do one. Not, yeah, this is half hour happy hour. It's not half hour <laughs> hour and a half hour. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hour me. and a half hour. It's your uh, show. Okay, all right, so people. Moral of the story: Moonbase. Moonbase. Moon, moon gas base. station. Moonbase. 
Eggs, d- uh, dealer's choice. And fuck eggs. Dealer's choice. Dealer's choice on dealer's eggs. Choice. Yes okay, or no? Yes Except or no? Except your dealer's choice on eggs. Uh, it's hot. So we get to leave it's the garage. Really hot. Yes. It's really good. That might be the best thing about this this episode uh, being being over. Yes, exactly. Now I can go drink. Yeah, there you go. All so right, well, uh, email us half hour happy hour fans at gmail dot com. Follow us on the tweetars half hour happy hr oh. at half hour happy hr. Correct, and uh, we'll get a poll. If Alex remembers yeah. to do it, we'll get a poll on which pictures. Yeah, 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 yeah. The new pictures. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah totally. And you're gonna email the Canada and woman and get us wine. All right, I need to and write we- some of this stuff down. <laughs> <laughs> we should go. I should write some stuff down. Okay. All right, people. That is it for this week's edition of the Half Hour Happy Hour with Allison and Alex. I'm Alex Albrecht. I'm Allison Hayslip. That's Tom Krajewski. I am pointing. (laughs) We will see you next week. Bye.